Yusuf from Ireland. He says that a lot of us immigrants living in the West are investing heavily in the West. And he is advising them that you guys come from uh, uh, nations and communities that are so poor and uh, so neglected. You should invest your money there. So he says, I don't know if I'm right or wrong. Well, Brother Yusuf, I don't know either whether you're right or wrong. For example, for Muslims to invest in countries that have a totalitarian regime, an oppressive regime to the Muslims, in countries where Muslims are lynched, killed, raped, and no one speaks about it in countries that Muslims are put in concentration camps and forced to take off their hijab, to shave their beards, to drink intoxicants and eat beards and, and eat pork in the middle of Ramadan so that they won't fast. They're, they're prevented from uh, uh, praying on time and they're forced to work in labor camps. Who in his right mind would invest in such countries, let alone try to uh, live there, or it should have been the opposite way. So I don't blame these immigrants who are investing in the West where it is safe, where, where there is law, they can go to and complain and sue anyone who oppresses them or tries to steal their money, and their investments are secured and halal, inshallah. So, so this is how I, I see it, and Allah knows best.